Welcome back guys, it's CryptoRocko here and in today's video we're talking about whether Bitcoin and cryptocurrency market cap can go to 40 trillion dollars. Is that possible guys? What are your thoughts? Watch this video to find out guys. So currently the Bitcoin cryptocurrency market cap is less than half a trillion, it's 430 billion dollars which is which has gone up from previously past few months it crashed and then the Bitcoin and cryptocurrency market is recovering. So we're going to watch a video from Pantera Capital Management head, uh, CEO Dan Moorhead he's done with Bloomberg's and we're going to watch that video and see his prediction of 40 trillion dollar market cap before we would get watch that video as usual guys we're going to give you a quick Bitcoin cryptocurrency market update then watch that video of 40 trillion dollar market cap I'm really excited to show you guys that video guys so the market has been recovering and it's good to see all green Bitcoin is going up which is good to see because Bitcoin is still king two coins that have been killing it in the past few weeks is EOS and Cardano. I've talked about Cardano previously guys, I'm a massive fan of Cardano and it's good to see Cardano coming back slightly. Um, Litecoin I'm a bit surprised, it's been going under the radar slightly, EOS and um, Cardano's gone over it. so. I think Litecoin might be uh, awaiting a pump, but we'll see what happens. Litecoin, I love that project. It's a very good project to follow, guys. And Neo is one of my favorite uh, big-term holds. Big, uh, I've got a big holdings of Neo, and it's a long-term hold for me. But currently, it's not doing as well as some of the other platform coins. B10 is a coin that I like. They're doing okay. They're doing well. Icon, I own some of Icon, but not as much. But they're another great, great project, and they're doing really well. Steam, you know. You know the project that I like, Verge. I don't need to give you guys my thoughts on Verge. Watch my previous videos on Verge. Um, Eternity. I don't know what that coin is, guys. It's been pumped massively. I don't know what's going on with it. I look into it a bit more, but it's been pumped hard. This coin. It's over Nano, which is a good coin. So I'm, I'm surprised with what's going on with Eternity. Ontology, guys. If you followed me, I'm sure you've made money from Ontology. I've actually told you when I when I sold Ontology and when I bought it back. So if you Follow me, I'm sure you've made money from Ontology. Where do I see Bitcoin cryptocurrency market going? We'll watch his, the, the expert's uh, view in a minute. But I think Bitcoin cryptocurrency will probably go to around 10, 10, 11 K before the pullback. But that's just my thoughts. So without further ado, let's watch the video. So you think Bitcoin's a screaming buyer? It is a screaming buyer. Bitcoin is a screaming buyer. Is it not nice to hear that, guys? It felt uh, when I watched this video. I think you should watch the full video. I'll, I'll send you guys a link. But it's, it made me feel really good when I was watching this video. Bitcoin could be worth ten times as much as it is now, or a hundred times as much as it is now. Yes, I think so. Bitcoin is one of many currencies, so keep that in mind. It's kind of the mega cap of the industry. There's some smaller caps. The industry as a whole is 400 billion. Easily could go to four trillion and forty. Definitely possible. It's the 10-year forecast. 40 trillion dollars, guys. Shall we watch that again? Did that not feel good to listen to? 40 trillion dollars. But one thing he did say is it's not short term, it's not gonna go to 40 trillion tomorrow. It's it's a long-term project. And if you believe in Bitcoin, blockchain, cryptocurrency, like I always, hodl and wait for it long term. Easily could go to four trillion and forty trillion is definitely 40 trillion guys so that's what his prediction is but why should we take his point of view seriously let's do a quick research on who Dan Moorhead is so he's um, he's worked in some of the best best companies in the world Goldman Sachs Deutsche Bank in London Bankers Trust and he, he ran a, a macro trading hedge fund Tiger Management so he's very experienced in this financial and cryptocurrency market so his point of view is something that we should take it seriously guys and then he started one of the biggest uh, cryptocurrency hedge funds he and he's also a board of directors of bitstamp if you do, if you don't know bitstamp is one of the biggest cryptocurrency ex exchange which is fourth largest bitcoin exchange and his cryptocurrency hedge fund is one of the mo most well respected and the biggest ones guys so we need to take his point of view very seriously and this is something that i really like what he said i, I think i've shared my blockchain vision but this is what he says people talk about five billion people in the developing world as being unbanked and it's like calling them on landline they skip the whole landline thing and went straight to mobile phones i think most for most purposes they're going to skip what we call traditional banking and go straight to more buy money and i think this is quite this can happen guys you know in africa in asia in bangladesh africa zimbabwe those countries guys they didn't actually have landline and they didn't use broadband internet 
they've gone straight to mobile phone they've got mobile banking transfer before we had that so they can do a jump and go into cryptocurrency blockchain and mobile and internet of money and crypto money before us so that's a very good interesting thought on like kind of the macro level why bitcoin and cryptocurrency can work so this was released on twitter guys and i highly recommend you guys watch the full video if you've got your time it's a very interesting video and if you're a blockchain supporter like myself you'll really enjoy watching it get your pop popcorn get a beer and watch that video you'll love it and then follow it follow dan moorhead on twitter he, he shares very interesting thoughts he's he's calling that bitcoin is already bottomed out i've I'm, i've been on the sidelines slightly saying oh i might not make money from it. i haven't gone all in bitcoin just yet but i mean he's saying that he thinks if he was a betting man he thinks we've seen the lows of the cycle so it's a great person to follow also guys follow me on um twitter i've almost uh, got my uh, 2000 subscribers which is great to see guys and i, I follow i post there a lot more regularly than youtube and i post very interesting stuff in, interesting stuff and you can maybe make money from it as well i post trading signals as well so follow me on twitter guys and help me reach my 2000 followers so finally guys i'd just like to say thank you very much for watching and i'd like to ask you what are your thoughts do you believe in dan moher do you think he's sharing uh, the correct information do you think we can hit 4 trillion 40 trillion um market cap and if we hit 40 trillion market cap bitcoin would probably have to be over a million dollars a million dollar bitcoin guys so we are very still we are at a very early stage but yeah what are your thoughts guys do you think bitcoin can reach a million do you think the market can can market cap can reach a, a trillion four trillion 40 trillion i'd be happy with one trillion market cap two trillion market cap 40 million is unheard of so yeah, share your thoughts guys, um, leave your comments below guys, I'd, I'd reply to all my comments and smash that like button, subscribe to my channel guys, it doesn't cost you anything, it means a lot to me and I'll be doing another half a Litecoin giveaway so subscribe to my channel if you want to win half a Litecoin and I shall see you guys soon with another great video.